Hey, what's going on you guys? It's your man James aka JP back again with the toy room and today is a very very special day because the DeLorean Motor Company posted on their social media platforms the brand new teaser for the brand new DeLorean that is going to be officially revealed on April 18th in Pebble Beach but so far we just got a little snippet a little back profile view of the car and right off the bat it looks amazing so uh, it's no secret that the DeLorean is my favorite car of all time obviously because of Back to the Future having such a strong influence in that but also so it's just such a unique car. I don't think there's any other car as popular as the DeLorean, as I guess revolutionary as the DeLorean. Like when it came out, it looked futuristic and still to this day, the original DeLorean is still a very futuristic car. And I don't think there's another car, another movie car, just any car in general in, in car culture or pop culture that is as iconic as the original DeLorean and obviously it's no secret that I'm a big fan of the car you know obviously I have my DeLorean shirt on I have an entire shelf dedicated to the DeLorean car I have the brand new DeLorean Lego set I have you know Back to the Future is my favorite movie of all time so to say I'm excited is uh, is an understatement uh, but I am extremely excited and what I just wanted to do in this video is take a look at the little teaser snippet that they gave of the DeLorean and kind of see how it compares to the original one and and what stuff that they're kind of carrying over, I guess, design-wise, and see just what little Easter eggs we can find just off of that little snippet that they gave us. It's not even a snippet, but just off of that little still image of the back of the car. So that's what I want to do in today's video. This is very, very exciting. Here we are almost 40 years later after the original DeLorean was made, and this was the only car that was ever made from this line. And obviously, you know, everything that happened with John DeLorean and the company going under, and then the company kind of staying afloat nowadays just by basically uh, servicing uh, the, the the original DeLoreans having those old parts it's a very very fascinating story and there's tons of documentaries out there just on the DeLorean itself not even back to the future but just the specific car itself so definitely very interesting stuff if you're into that kind of stuff like I am I've probably seen every single DeLorean documentary there is out there but without further ado I know I'm starting to ramble on so let's go ahead and take a look at this image that was posted on the DeLorean Motor Company social media today and see what little Easter eggs and just cool design choices uh, that we're gonna get from this brand new DeLorean. All right, so without further ado, let's go ahead and take a look. All right, you guys, and here we go. Here is the brand new teaser for the brand new DeLorean. Now, right off the bat, just a quick fact, this is going to be an electric vehicle, which honestly makes sense with the DeLorean. The DeLorean always felt like it was a futuristic type of vehicle, uh, and it is gonna be electric, and I'm assuming it is going to be pretty quick, as electric vehicles normally are. But you can see just with the styling here, this does look like it's a modern day supercar, which is fitting, because because the original DeLorean, honestly, if you know anything about that engine, it was not a fast car whatsoever. The engine that they put in it was actually really slow, and the car always looked like it should be fast, and it never was, which is disappointing. But anyways, let's go ahead and start with the biggest thing that we can see here. So if we move up to the door right here and going up to the roof line, you can see the cutout for the door coming all the way up the roof line and then cutting to a curve right here down the middle. So obviously, yes, we are getting those iconic gold wing doors. And let's be honest, if they made this car and didn't put the gold wing doors on it, like what are you doing at that point? So you can see the cutout for the doors. They are going to be gold wing doors, which is just amazing. And this car definitely needed to have that. And obviously that's a callback to the original DeLorean. Now, another call back to the original DeLorean is if we look at the rear window right here now it's kind of hard to tell exactly what this is if this is the glass that's shaped like this or what the case is but you can see these uh, obviously like black uh, markings right here and that is that's a style design from the original DeLorean over the engine cover now I'm assuming you know this isn't going to be an engine cover because if this is an electric vehicle there's obviously no engine so I don't really know entirely what this is. I guess it's just going to be, I don't know, some sort of, to me it looks like glass. Uh, or maybe this is just the way the shadows are playing off the back of the car, but I don't think so. I think this is intentional and I think this is a callback to the original DeLorean's design. Now if we scroll down here, you can see it says DeLorean right across the back just like the bumper did on the original DeLorean, which is very nice, but it's done in this new modern futuristic type of font right here. Now, what's interesting is that right there in the E, you can see the Italian flag, and that's because this was designed in Italy. This whole transformation of this car and everything that they did was designed in Italy. It is just interesting to see that they are going that far with the branding uh, to call it, you know, an Italian car or whatever. So that that's interesting. It's not too much of an eyesore, and I really didn't even notice it 
until I started like zooming into the picture. So uh, very subtle and I do like that. I do like these tail lights a lot too. You can see they are very futuristic looking with their light bars, but I do kind of prefer that original version of the DeLorean just a little bit more. And you can see obviously this would be the reverse light right here. Uh, and then obviously this car is done in silver because why not? Now, do I think it will be stainless steel? I highly doubt it. I think it's just going to be your regular silver paint. So you have that right there. And then I'm still trying to figure out what exactly this line is right here here on the trunk now i'm not entirely sure because it goes from like the, the trunk all the way up through the glass so i'm not i don't have the slightest idea what this would be maybe the charging port but it's throwing me off with the line going into the glass uh it's just very confusing especially because this line doesn't go into the glass so maybe this line on the glass is just like some sort of reflection playing tricks on us but definitely this may possibly be the charging port. Other than that, I have no idea what it can actually be. I doubt it's any sort of active spoiler just because it's a weird shape. It's a very small cutout. Obviously, we can't see the rest of the car. Uh, you also do have this little silver spot right here, which is on the window. So maybe that's just reflections or stuff. I'm not entirely sure what that could be. And I think that's all of really the easter eggs that we can find off of this i mean there's not too much else you can see it's just the rear diffuser right here uh but this does look like it's going to be a modern day supercar similar to how the acura nsx was revamped and even at this angle i'm kind of getting some audi r8 vibes so i have a feeling it's going to look something like that but i really hope this somehow some way resembles the original delorean because right now this is already looking way more rounded than the original delorean was obviously the original delorean was more boxy and more squared off so you can see this is just a lot of roundness going to it and up here as well on the roof line and all that so um yeah i think that's the biggest things that we can see is definitely the gold wing doors you can see the cutout for the gold wing doors right there you can see whatever this is is a callback to the delorean's design as well as the delorean imprint right there just like the original delorean so that is pretty much it as far as everything we can see like i said stay tuned for april 18th that's when the official reveal is going to be happening and i cannot be any more excited man this this is just wow what a what a time to be alive all right you guys so there was a quick look at the brand new delorean obviously this isn't the full thing obviously you know it's just the back profile and in just oh uh, i think it's like a week and a half we're gonna get the official reveal and uh, again i cannot be any more excited i'll definitely be doing a follow-up video to this video once it is officially unveiled and we'll take a look at all the design elements and all the specs pricing you know performance stuff with the horsepower and all that i know i don't normally do car videos but i am a car guy i have done other car videos in the past and this is not just any car this is the delorean so i'm definitely super super excited for this if you guys couldn't already tell so uh yeah that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did make sure you like comment and subscribe share this video with your friends be sure to follow me on instagram that link's in the description down below and that's pretty much it i'm gonna go ahead and get on out of here so as always guys stay tuned for more and i'll see you guys next time